All the scripts in this video can be found over at robloxscripts.com, link in the description. Like this video and subscribe for more daily scripts. What up everybody, it's your boy Roblox Scripts coming at you guys with another video. And in today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to download, install and execute scripts using Cryptic. So Cryptic is a brand new executor for Roblox Android. You can use this on PC by downloading an emulator and you'll be able to execute scripts on PC, which is what I'm going to be showing you guys how to do in today's video. So Cryptic is brand new. It came out like last week. And it is a reskin of Vels. You may remember Vels. Here's a picture on the screen if you don't know what Vels is. Vels used to be a PC executor and a mobile executor, which hasn't been updated in months. But this appears to be a reskin of the Android version of Vels, which I haven't got a problem with. As long as Cryptic works and it updates on time, I have no issues. So let's not waste any more time. Let's get straight into the video. Click the link in the description below and it will take you over to robloxscripts.com and it will take you over to this page right here. So make sure to bookmark this website if you haven't already. Scroll down and before we get any further into this, I just want to warn you guys, don't use any main accounts. Roblox staff have already said that they've, they're have they preparing to put Hyperion on Android at any time now. So it could be another four months waiting, it could be next month, it could be this week, we have no idea. But we would know for a fact that Roblox has got some very good surprises in store for Android users in the future. So remember guys, stay safe, only use alt accounts, don't use any main accounts, protect your headless core blocks. You can't say I didn't warn you. So we've got the download link and we've got the link to the Cryptic Discord, which I highly recommend you guys join if you want to get uh, updated whenever the APK is ready to use after Roblox updates and you want to get any news from the dev you can go and join the Cryptic Discord. So remember guys, there is pop ads on this website. Just close them down and go back to the page. Click on download latest version here. Now this is a link that ties. You can bypass this with Bypass City. So just go to a, a website like Bypass City and you can bypass this, but I've got link that ties premium. So I could just go straight ahead and click to the pastebin link, or you could just type in the pastebin link, whatever you prefer. So this will always have the updated version of Cryptic. If Cryptic is ever out of date, then please join this Discord server and ping me. But hey, here is the link. So we're going to download Cryptic from the media file link. Very, very simple download. Literally just click download and we're good to go. So the next thing you're going to need is you're going to need an emulator. The emulator that I recommend you guys use is LD Player 9. I've never used Moomoo Moo Player myself, so I can't exactly comment on how it performs. But I've used LD Player since day one and LD Player is my go-to Android emulator. Once you've downloaded the APK, just simply drag it into the emulator like so and it will install Roblox. So you can see right there, it just said install Roblox and we should see the Roblox app pop up on the screen any second now. So just wait till Roblox pops up. Okay, so Roblox has finally installed. This is the cryptic Android executor. So we're gonna load into Roblox right now. It should prompt us to log in. So we're gonna log in and we're gonna load into a base plate. Okay, so I've just signed in. We're gonna load into the base plate now and whichever game you load into, as long as the game does not detect your executor, you should be good to go. Some games like Blade Ball, they have detections for certain executors so they will kick you from the game upon joining, but I'm just joining the base plate right now just to show you guys that this does work. So this is what Cryptic looks like and as you can see, it's literally a ripoff of, of the Vals UI. It's the exact same UI. Got a little FPS unlocker here. I don't think this has auto execute. But it does seem to have a script hub. Let me just test if this actually works. Can we actually search for things? I don't know. Did that actually work? I don't know if that did work. Let's try again. Let's see if we could search for UNC. Okay, so we could search for UNC right here. Let's just do a quick UNC test. I just clicked on execute script. So hopefully that works. Okay, so you guys can see that we scored 100% on the UNC test. The execution was kind of iffy. It didn't execute on the first time that we clicked the execute button. We had to spam it a few times for it to actually work. But we scored 100% on the UNC test. Now, I don't actually know if they're faking functions or not. I haven't tested this out, but 100% looks promising and everything I've tried to execute so far works. So I'm going to end the video with a, a little montage of me using scripts with Cryptic. I hope you guys have enjoyed this. Enjoy using Cryptic. Remember, stay safe. Use alt accounts only. Subscribe if you haven't already. Comment down below what you guys want to see next. And remember to leave a like. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.